Hi, my pretties. It is Thursday, May 11th. I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, I was wrong. Thursday, May 12th. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Um, but I'm just hanging out. I should stop shaking the table. Um, yeah. Hi. Uh, today I picked up the rest of my stuff from my old apartment, which was nice. And I need to actually hurry because my dad will come home soon. And then he'll be like, what are you doing talking to your computer? And I'll be like, I'm just talking to my computer. What's wrong with that? I look really like soft focus, soft focus. Does that help? No. No. It's not help. Sorry guys, not going to help today. So, yeah. I like it better like that. Um, I've been watching The Five Awesome Gays lately. And it's sad. It's like, oh my goodness. I kind of started off my YouTube-ness watching them and following them. And I've gone through most of the guys that have left and everything like that. And now they're just starting to stop. And it's it's, it's sad panda. I'm just like, oh my goodness. Especially when Joe was on today. I was just like, it's so sad. It's so sad. But that's okay. Because, you know... It's kind of one of those things where it's like you either move on because you can't keep working where you're working. Like you can't just keep going with it. So you need to um, move on and like get a new creative flow going because sometimes too much of a good thing is, isn't, isn't good or something. You know, those crazy lines people say. Oh, white people. No, I'm joking. Um, my hair looks really light right now. I like it. So, yeah, that was my day. I went to Starbucks and got myself some chai soy. And it was delicious. And it wasn't hot. It was nice and cold. And it was, oh, it was so good. And, um, maybe I can get Ame down here. Ame! We'll see if he comes running down here. He might not. He doesn't care for vlogs, clearly. Does it? Are you guys a little weirded out because I'm recording and it's like daytime and you can see the sun? Do you guys want to see where I live? Clearly. Can you see up there? Yeah, we still have lights on. <laughs> like that. And yeah. So it's super sunny today. It's um it was raining this morning actually a little bit. And they say it might rain again this evening. But for that little pocket of time it was beautiful and it was warm and I wore just a cardigan and it just was nice see I'm wearing my little my little dress thing it's so fancy um so yeah that's what I did I just went and took the puppy for a walk afterwards after I brought myself home so thankful to Sarah today because she oh my goodness without her I would have been screwed because I didn't realize I had left that much stuff in the old apartment I had to like oh my goodness I shoved so much stuff into a little little cart and I didn't realize I would need my backpack so I didn't bring my backpack I'm not smart like that and just you know just mixed feelings and stuff so goodbye old apartment I'm finally done I've left my keys hopefully I will call my landlord again I'm gonna keep calling him until he gives me back most of my deposit because I the place is like perfect still all you have to do a little slap of paint you're done it's good we were super clean super quiet we never complained we've actually got complained twice and it was so annoying because it's like you know what people make mistakes and just because it's late at night like we were babysitting and the girl rang the wrong door doorbell and it rang to our neighbors because they have a really weird doorbell system where one is on the bottom and two is on top so she thought the first one was unit one and she rang it and they were mad and I was just like what's your deal like sometimes these mistakes happen and I get if you have to work in the morning and I get if something goes on like it's not okay but like it's not cool when you just think that oh we're just gonna complain like we are nice people we are super friendly I'm super friendly like I make sure that I try to make people feel welcome and included so it was just a little obnoxious for something to end like that. But we'll see what happens. 
Um, and I'm actually really excited because I have a couple people I'm going to be starting doing photo shoots with. And I really, really want to work with them. And, like, honestly, like, it's about the experience. And if people are going to be mad about bad photos and bad stuff like that, like, what can you do? That's what Photoshop's for. That's what, um, experimenting is for. Like, if you're growing professionally, you need to experiment. So, for people who are, get mad at photographers or makeup artists, like, calm down. Honestly, like... There's a million of us out there, and just take it as a learning experience. Like, maybe you get a bad photo one day, but, like, you come back another day and not go so slow and catch the time you want, and you'll get, like, amazing photos. So it's just kind of, like, first impressions are really hard to, like, it takes two years to get over a first impression. And sometimes, even for me, it's hard for me to get over people's first impressions because I'm very impressionable, impressionable, and I just... Oh, some people just rub off on me wrong. I'm, I'm very set in my ways, too, I guess. I'm very stubborn. So, um, yeah. I'm going to see you guys before this video gets too long and probably cut off at the end. But stay beautiful, my pretties.